Flight Risk Music presents the legendary rock venue. The Fillmore, San Francisco's legendary rock haven. Nestled in the heart of San Francisco's Fillmore District, stands a modest red brick building that has earned an outsized reputation as one of the most legendary concert venues in rock and roll history. The Fillmore Auditorium opened its doors over 50 years ago and quickly became the epicenter of the exploding psychedelic rock scene of the late 1960s. Legends like the Grateful Dead, Jefferson Airplane, and Janis Joplin frequently graced the Fillmore stage during the height of the Summer of Love era. What made the Fillmore so special? Beyond the incredible talent that performed there, it was the intimate atmosphere of the standing room only, balconied concert hall that created a deep connection between musicians and fans. The venue only holds about 1,200 people, tiny compared to today's arena shows. It was like playing in someone's living room, recalls Roger Daltrey of The Who. The dance hall style meant fans could get close to the stage to watch fiery guitar licks and intricate drum solos up close. Equally important was the visionary management of promoter Bill Graham. Graham treated both fans and musicians with respect, ensuring reasonable ticket prices and facilities, like a complimentary coat check and apples for concert goers. His innovations, like psychedelic light shows, enhanced the magical ambience of seeing your favorite band at the Fillmore. While rock music and San Francisco have changed dramatically over the decades, Fillmore has retained its prestige as one of the best places to catch live music. Legends like the late Prince and current artists like the Arctic Monkeys have graced the hallowed venue. The rich history permeates the walls, along with memories of music that defined an era. In an age of massive corporate arenas, the Fillmore remains an intimate sanctuary where fans can connect with artists and forever be part of the story of rock and roll.